Hi, it's James, and it's day two of the 12 Days of Procreate. So get out your iPads, tap the link in the description below to get the assets that go with this video, and get ready to learn how with a single tap, you can add architectural symbols, ff and &E, people, trees, and plants to the plans, elevations, and renderings you make in Procreate. To use the brush stamps in the Architect's Brush Set Library, make sure you've tapped on the Architect Brush Set. Scroll to the top and locate the brush stamp set you like. Highlight it. Pick the color you would like and tap once in the middle of the sheet. Select the symbol you would like using the rectangular selection mode. Drag it across the symbol and tap copy and paste at the bottom. That symbol will open up on its own layer. Then tap off the original sheet of stamps. Tap the Move tool and move that stamp or resize that stamp any way you'd like using the Move and Transform tool. To use any of the other unique brush stamps in the set, Go to your left side brush library list, select FF and E, select the FF and E group you would like, in this case the bedroom, select the color you want, and tap firmly in the middle of the screen. Then use the selection tool to isolate the unit you want, tap copy and paste at the bottom of the sheet. That unit is automatically added to its own layer. Turn off the sheet layer and move the unit you've selected anywhere you want. Notice that the FF and E templates come in already at eighth inch and quarter inch scale, so they need no further adjustment. To use the brush stamps in the Entourage set and change the color of those stamps, tap the set that you would like, in this case the trees, tap firmly in the center of the screen, tap again if you're a little bit off, choose the brush you would like using the freehand selection tool, Tap copy and paste to add that item to its own layer and turn off the underlying template layer. Resize and reposition that image however you'd like. Adjust the hue, saturation, and brightness of the image using the adjustment menu, hue, saturation, and brightness. And to add color to that item, tap the layer bar, tap select, choose the soft airbrush in the Architects brush library, change the color to a brighter yellow green, Adjust the size of the brush and apply that color over the appropriate part of the tree. Choose a tan for the tree trunk and choose a darker green for the shade side of the tree, adjusting the size of the brush as you see fit. You can also add shadows in a darker gray to the trunk of the tree and even to the side of the tree away from the sun. To add people to your scenes, tap in the Entourage brush library, choose the sheet and style of people you would like. 
add a layer for the people. Tap firmly in the center of the screen. Use the rectangle selection tool to select the person you would like. Tap copy and paste to add that item to its own layer. Turn off the underlying template layer. Reposition the person and or resize the person. And to tint that person, simply choose a color and drag and drop that color into the figure. You can also independently select the entire figure, tap in the brush menu for the airbrush, and apply the color to the person. Don't forget to download the free assets in the description below. To see the next video in this series, click on the video you see here, and I'll see you in the next video.